हेलो एवरी वन माई नेम इज अमोल मोरे एंड वेलकम टू अवर चैनल सोल्यूशन टू ब्लैक बुक ना टूडे वन ऑफ अवर स्टूडेंट्स हैज आस्ट अस द क्वेश्चन रिलेटिंग टू डिटर्मिनेंट्स द क्वेश्चन इज द रूट्स ऑफ द इक्वेशन दिस लेट मी से आई एक्सप्रेस साइन थीटा इज एस एंड कॉस थीटा एज सी सो दैट वी कैन राइट दिस वेरी इफेक्टिवली सो दिस विल बी थ्री एक्स स्क्वेर एक्स स्क्वेर प्लस सी एक्स प्लस सी स्क्वेर एक्स स्क्वेर प्लस एस एक्स प्लस एस स्क्वेर एंड देन एक्स स्क्वेर प्लस सी एक्स प्लस सी स्क्वेर एंड देन थ्री एस सी स्क्वेर वन प्लस एस टू थीटा बाय टू एंड लास्ट रो लास्ट कॉलम इज एक्स स्क्वेर प्लस एस एक्स प्लस एस स्क्वेर एंड देन वन प्लस एस टू थीटा बाय टू एंड द लास्ट एलिमेंट इज दिस ओके इज इक्वल टू जीरो नाव इन सच क्वेश्चन यू हैव टू शो सम स्मार्टनेस बिकॉज दिस इज अ प्योरली जे डब्ल्यू मेन्स क्वेश्चन ओके आई वुडन से जस्ट चेक बाय द ऑप्शन बट अ लिटल बिट ऑफ स्किल इज रिक्वायर्ड इफ बाय पुटिंग सम वैल्यू ऑफ एक्स योर डिटर्मिनंट इज गोइंग जीरो देन बाय फैक्टर थियरम यू कैन से दैट दैट पर्टिकुलर वैल्यू ऑफ एक्स इज द रूट ऑफ द इक्वेशन or the determinant it's a factor of the determinant now just by looking at uh, this particular uh, determinant there's one thing that you definitely need to do is write down the sin 2 theta as 2 sin theta cos theta then 2 2 will get cancelled and sin theta cos theta will remain okay so let me write that down once again 3x square x square plus cx plus c square x square plus s x plus s square and then it will be x square plus c x plus s square and uh, then it will be x square plus s x plus s square this will be 3 c square and this will be 1 plus sin theta cos theta 1 plus s c this will be 1 plus s c and this will be 3 c square okay that is equal to 0 okay so this is our simplified form so let us rub this earlier form which that won't be required as of now now you need to think about some value of x which might turn this determinant into zero so thinking about such values is very very easy the values are right there inside your determinant only as to which i see sin theta so let me put x as sin theta so if i put x as sin theta how would this equation look like so 3c 3s square plus here s square plus c square would be 1 1 plus and then c s 1 plus c s and then here s square plus s square would be 2 s square and uh, then it will be s s into s s square so 2 s square plus s square it would be 3 s square okay then over here again it will be s s square plus s square 2 s square plus c s so let me write down 2 square plus cs and over here 3c square and over here nothing 1 plus sc and over here s square plus s square plus s square 3 square and over here 1 plus sc and over here 3c 3s square okay the last element was mistakenly written as c square it is s square as you can check 3s square now check out the first row and the last row are they same yes they are same it means two rows are directly identical when we put x as sin theta therefore x as sin theta is one of the roots of the equation similarly when we will put x as cos theta that will be one of the roots of the equation hence the correct option to this question would be option a so how did we do this we did this directly by factor theorem you just needed to think some value of x which might give you uh, the answer as 0 so once i put s as x as sin theta i got two rows identical and i got the determinant as 0 similarly this is a very symmetric see the pattern this is a very very symmetric determinant hence if one root is sin theta the other root would be directly cos square theta as you see in option 
see that won't be the case because this de determinant is a symmetrical determinant hence the other value will definitely be cos theta you can yourself check by putting x as cos theta your second and the third row will definitely second and the first row will definitely tally and you will get the answer